last time. Isaac What's going on, everyone? Welcome back to another episode of The Binding of Isaac Repentance. Uh, last run, we, we made something out of nothing. And, uh, you know... It, it is what it is. We almost got a, a fat dub, but now we only have a uh, moderate dub to remember, but that's all right. Let's, uh, let's try ultra hard. You guys like ultra hard? Throw a challenge run into the mix. So for ultra hard, we got to get to Mega Satan. We, we start with the key. We get four curses each floor, possibly more, no health drops. Um, all enemies that can have champion forms do have champion forms. Uh, I'm probably missing something else, but that's uh, that's about it. So basically, uh, light work, very easy. Uh, they should have called it uh, ultra easy because of how easy it's going to be. Oh yeah, I don't know what item that is. Blood rights. Cool. Uh, there are no health drops, so that kind of sucks, honestly. But, uh, you know, it, it is what it is. We'll just deal with it and keep on chug-a-lugging. Uh, we'll also try not to get hit at all, because every hit is significantly more consequential now that everything's going to be hitting me for a uh, full one. Please. Oh, we didn't get hit there somehow. All right. Uh, good, good start. We haven't taken damage yet. And there's our second item room. I hope it's awesome. I hope it's something that absolutely. Ooh, my goodness, it scared me. Oh my lord. My Lanta took damage because my phone went off. That is so sad. That's all right, though. We'll, we'll, we'll come back from that. Because of uh, this sack of pennies right here. Uh, do note, I now have two hearts, and that's just going to be how it is. Because hearts can't drop at all. And I think even items are like... I'm pretty sure items that drop hearts will not drop them either. That, that room was just never going to end if I didn't do that. Uh, this is... Uh, we're, we're, we're doing pretty cool. Doing pretty cool stuff to start with. I'm a little concerned. But all we have to do is get through uh, all of our... Oh, did I mention the double troubles? Bosses that can be double troubles will be double troubles. I don't think that can happen on the basement. But beyond the basement, it's double trouble time. This is, uh, I really don't want to die to spiders. That'd be really sad. Mom's locket, you feel her love. Is there any, like, three cent cool stuff in here? There would be a heart. <laughs> but there's not. Um, alright. Well, boss time. There he is, there's Pestilence. He's gonna give us a cube of meat. That's what we were looking for. Keep, keep it up, Pestilence. This is like a pretty good champion to get, though. He doesn't spawn enemies, right? He just shoots... Shoots a bunch of bullets. Who knows? Maybe we'll get another, like, really easy champion. And we'll get a health up. I don't know if health ups are off limits. I haven't done a lot of research into the Ultra Hard Challenge. I just know, uh... <laughs> the reward for getting it done is super cool. Alright. Nice. Oh. This is gonna be super, super easy. Alright, come on. Uh, but yeah, no, I, I figure I might as well give... Give it a shot. Because... I'm gonna... God, he's, he's taking more damage. I'm gonna have to get all these challenges done anyway. And as, as stated, this is probably one of the most difficult challenges... Not without its reward, though. Let me remind you that the reward for finishing this challenge is probably the greatest reward you could get in all of Isaac. 
I, I don't know if I'm brazen enough to try to use cube of meat for damage right now. I think we'll just oh, I think we'll just keep our distance. We got lucky to cube of meat even existed there because otherwise that was a L. The world's fattest L. Gosh, he is this champion just have like a lot of health? Or am I really just not outputting any damage? Could be a mix of both. All right, you're done. Let's get these spiders out of here. And let's see what he drops us. Could be something cool. HP up. Let's go. Uh, let's just assume that we're going to get something crazy from the angel room and ignore that devil room. We're going to keep on going. So, as you notice, the floors are always going to be like XL floors. And on top of them always being XL floors, uh, they're also always going to be like Curse of the Lost, Curse of the Sauce, uh, Curse of the Whatever. I don't know if it can be more than just the four curses. Probably can. But, at, ouch. At least four curses every floor. Yep, we, uh, we've been teleported. Good. Um... I hold out some some hope. Okay, that turned into two enemies. That sucks. Uh, we are dead. <clears throat> That's all right. Us dying just means it's time to start another run, baby. We'll ignore that. Fruit cake. There it is. That's the one. That's the that's the run uh, the run carrier right there. Because it'll just always give us the effects we need to kill everybody. I hope. I'm curious. Curious to you guys out there. What uh, what do you think the hardest challenge is? If not for Ultra Hard. Let, let's just say that Ultra Hard's not on the table. And that we're excluding it from the hardest challenge list. Well, what do you guys think the hardest challenge is? Please die, I, I beg of you. Oh, I didn't know that he's gonna blow up into bullets. Um, like Onan's streak is pretty difficult. Um, I'm trying to think if there's any others that are like super turbo hard. Uh, Bloody Mary, kind of difficult. Please, please stop making enemies. Thank you. Um, what else? I would say that the, the super glitch run is only kind of difficult from the fact that sometimes you just get items that make you lose the game. But it's fun, though. It's like a fun difficult. Alright, here comes the cube of meat part two, baby. And we got the, the... Oh, I ran into it. We got the champion pestilence. He's a real, real guy. Real dude. Please stop. Stop running at me. If we keep getting the champion pestilence for the first floor boss, I feel like at least one of the bosses we will be able to kill. Because he is pretty easy. And honestly, let's just, uh... I would take the plum flute. Ooh, we almost got hit there. Ow. I, uh... It's alright. We're, we're, we're still on track for plum fluting it up. We're, we're, we're still there. You can leave. Alright, goodbye. Alright, let's keep going. No reason to full clear. We will just uh, inevitably perish. On to the next floor. So. Get him. Get him. Plum Jr. Thank you. Fly is easy. It, it, we just uh just gotta find like some health items. And we'll be we'll be doing good. Cause we know that they're not going to drop naturally. Can't go in there. I'm not like aside from just being good, which I hope is not the only case scenario for victory. I'm not sure what the, the plan is for Ultra Hard, like what your your end goal is. 
If there's any overarching strategies that would just be sick. I that scares me a lot. Oh man. Is there no enemies in here? I don't know where I am. Um Okay, this this is not cool. That's oh god, it's so much range. You're so small, stop. Let's uh, throw this here. Maybe get two kills. Throw another one here. Can this drop parts at all? No, it's just like a waste of my bomb. Nice! Kind of cool, honestly. I think that is pretty sick. A pretty funny move. That even tinted rocks give you nothing. Least they could do is make it give me my bomb back so the cost of discovery is not so high. But that's alright. We'll keep on going along. We know what we need to do. Little Brimstone. He's, he's that guy. Pretty good. I mean, I'd say he's up there. In a sense of, like, items being solid. Little Brim's pretty, pretty solid for a familiar. Does a decent amount of damage. In a line. We love line damage dealers. Yeah, sorry about that. I had to blow my nose. So I could get serious. Get this serious dub. I'm glad that those guys don't have champion variants. Because I hate those guys. Uh, ha dude, half price item? Steel. Hive mind? That's whatever. Uh, normal price item? Steel. Charge baby? That's also pretty whatever. Maybe we could get a bomb or something, blow that guy up and get that pill, and it'd be like a full health pill. Get him. Oh, don't get me. Get him. Oh, he's taking so much damage. All right. Here, here's where it's the, the play. Play the game. It's the bomb into the five cents, into the pill, into the full health. Something's wrong. You know, it was, it was close. That was almost a full health. Uh, do we just fight the boss? We only got one item. I mean, honestly, let's just... Oh, wow. Uh, when, when they say the bosses are double trouble, they mean even like the... The... the oh, even the these bosses are double trouble. So it's actually four bosses a floor. That's fine. That's okay. We'll just win. We're just going to win instead. And then we got Roid Rage. Cool. Alright. The lariest of juniors and a pin. We're, we're okay with the Larry Jr. pin combo. I, I think that was actually probably one of the better options we could have gotten. And Mom's MFN Lipstick. Uh, let's go find our item room. Yeah. I believe we were missing an item room. What did we pick up this floor? We picked up uh, a little brimstone. I believe. It was our... Yeah, this item. We got some poop here. There, there's so much room in the double trouble rooms. I, You know, it's not that bad. But also, we're on the first... However... Oh, no! Okay, no, it's it's good. It's good. It's all good. We just keep on chug a luggin. Um, yeah, this isn't great. We just get some just some bad RNG for these champion enemies. Not even, not even that bad. We just uh, just keep on grooving. It'd be nice to get that deal with the devil the first floor, so we could get the deal with the angel the second floor. I feel like that would be pretty advantageous. Um, oh, he's a goop. No! Okay. Uh, what do we want in this item room? Yeah, just, just something awesome. We want something sick. Yum Heart would be kind of cool. I think you can still get healing items. Thanks. You guys could just uh, leave. Thank you. Cancer. You know. I got crab hands. I mean, that'll at least help me survive a little bit. Me and my crab hands. 
can't be too upset over a little bit of crab time. Ow. Okay, so taking damage from spiders is not in our agenda. So we're going to prevent ourselves from doing that again. Can you die? Thank you. Uh, let's go find the other item room, maybe. We, we do okay. That's fine. I love the stone guys. The stone guys are very cool. That they not only do they not take damage, but they're there just to be annoying. And they don't block their shots, but they do block my shots. I think that's a uh, pretty cool. I think it's a pretty cool thing that it does. Get away from me. Uh, would you guys? What would you guys say is worse, the stone guys or uh, the? The portals that spawn enemies. I mean, the portals used to be a lot worse. Don't get me wrong. They used to be some suck encounters. But... What is going on here? I'm about to take damage. Hold up. Alright, cellular crisis averted. Cool. Three spiders. I like that room. I, I don't like that room. I lied. Was actually incorrect. I meant to say I hate that room. But it's okay. Where's our second item room at? We need the second item room. This is certainly not one of those runs I can just go about not picking up the second item. Fire room. Cool. Toasty. Here it is. Alright, creep man. You gotta go. Alright, creep man, you're gone. Alright, what do you guys think the second item room is going to be? Uh, I think it's going to be, um, um, kamikaze. Spider butt. Close. It was a spacebar item. I, I got 50% of it right. The very, like, the 50 nondescript percent of it. Alright, boss. Become spider butted. We no longer want your chalice. I stood directly in the path of that. That's okay. I blew myself up. That's okay. I took damage. That's okay. Uh, not really utilizing cancer's benefits very well. Uh, just, just eat this bomb. Thank you. What on earth was that? Um, okay. Cool. That's, uh, that's, that's, that's new. I, I don't remember, uh, don't remember Edmund adding in the airstrike, but we'll take it. This, this, uh, yep, just bomb him. See you later. Bombs are gonna be our friends. We don't have a lot of them, unfortunately. Synth oil, sick. Next floor. Oh, boy! No, oh, Curse of the Labyrinth, no way! It's a big room to have nothing in it. Oh, the item room! Oh, GB Bug! I wonder if GB Bug can re-roll stuff into hearts. Ouch. This, I, I feel like we're just gonna die here. That's alright though. Sometimes you just gotta die. We, he's a uh, little bit of a, little bit of a challenge here. You can almost say a challenge run. Can you stop doing that attack, please? I don't have enough real estate to run away from that attack. Uh, no. BB Bug, get it. Fuck yes! GB Bug re-rolled it into nothing! Woo! Let's go! GB Bug! GB Bug! GB Bug! You get AIE to move. Move somewhere. It's not where you're at. That's also not really somewhere that I want you to be. Alright, cool. Uh... 
Let's keep up the work, GB Bug. Just keep on keeping on. Let's reroll that. Reroll that key. GB Bug, please. Dude, one cent. That's fire. Now, I, I, well, don't even need to worry about it. Uh, we'll give it one more good go. One more again, if you will. Alright, this is going to be the, the one that carries us. Chocolate milk. Good start. We're, we're big chocolate milk fans. I, I Chocolate milk could carry. It's like a solid damage item. Just, uh, I can charge my shots and hopefully send them in a way that doesn't make me get hit by enemies. I'm not even going to attempt to attempt to go into that curse room. Because it will offer me nothing. The traditional benefit of curse rooms are null and void, because... Oh! Health is uh, no longer an asset in which I can find readily. See you later, dork. Dead bird? Yo, that's so dead bird. Now every time I get hit, which is going to be uh, always, I can just uh, hide. All right. The Larry Meister. The Ouchie Meister. Get him, dead bird. Give him the business. I like how the first boss room counts as part of the floor, not like part of the boss room. I guess it makes sense from the way that the second boss room shows up, but, you know. Uh, so, old bandage is just like a hollow HP up, which, I'll be real with you, basically like not getting an item. Because the normal trigger for old bandage is that sometimes uh, when you get hit, you drop health. I don't think you can drop health, so... We basically didn't get an item for that, unless we get another HP up here, which then fills that container. It's, it's possible. Never, uh, it, it, we didn't though, we got the, the belty poo. The old Beltmeister. That's okay. On to the next floor. Uh, we're gonna win. It's winning time again. As long as we can uh, keep hitting our enemies. And this is basically this is just practice for Onan's streak. Oh, Lord. Which I would have been dead by now. But that's alright. Get him. Yeah. Dude, what if there was a pill in that mushroom? That would have been sick. Ouch. Of course. We love champions that uh, explode into bullets. Get him, dead bird. Dead bird do be helping to limit the amount of damage I take per floor. Does dead bird seem faster than he used to be? My man is just kind of zooming. Okay, good room, good room. All right, now oh, he's invisible, sick. Get him, get him. I hate yellow flies. I hate yellow flies. Dude, he's producing so many. This is so not good. Stop. Why are you you're producing two instead of one? And you're invisible. That seems very overkill. Alright, thank you, Dead Bird. Dead Bird turning out to be kind of awesome. Kind of a really big helper here. Infestation, fly revenge. Uh, that is kind of whatever. You got the, the poo guys. Alright, uh, this one's gonna be... Uh, <laughs> that's worthless. Scorpio, Scorpio. I said it was gonna be Scorpio. And he was, that's crazy. That's wild. Even. Um... I guess we'll make our way to the boss now, hopefully. And uh, maybe we can even get a deal with the devil after we beat both of them without taking any damage. I think that would be pretty snazzy. Uh, Scorpio, one of the okayer of the 
poison effects better than oh, common cold, which is like just a chance. And then I think there's another one. Serpent's Kiss? Is that poison? Yeah, I can't remember. I can't remember. Oh, that's sick, dude. Cool chest. Alright, you gotta go. You two also have to leave. Don't have to go home, but you can't stay here. Just circle around, do the safe thing. Look at that. Easy. This challenge run is for, uh, for babies. Fudge. All right, well, that's, uh, well, well, I think we'll call that there. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this attempt at an episode of The Binding of Isaac, Repentance. Uh, if you did, leave a like, subscribe, maybe. Let me know how you felt down below. Uh, until next time, I'll see ya when I see ya. Ciao.